Welcome to DSNews.com. I'm Kelly Snowgren, and this is your top default servicing news for the weekend. Over the last year, sales for distressed properties fell sharply, according to Realty Track's first quarter foreclosure and short sale report. The share of foreclosure related sales, which includes properties in any stage of foreclosure and REOs, represented 21% of all sales in the first quarter, down from 25% a year ago. In addition, the share of properties that were not in foreclosure but sold as a short sale fell to 15% during the same time period, down 10% from the previous quarter and down 30 35% from a year ago. Karen Blomquist, VP at Realty Track, offered up an explanation for the first quarter data, stating, quote, We expected foreclosure related sales to be lower given the downward trend in new foreclosure activity nationwide over the past two and a half years. But the decrease in non foreclosure short sales was a bit of a surprise given the 11 million homeowners nationwide still underwater. Rising home prices in many markets are stunting the continued growth of short sales by reducing incentive for both underwater homeowners and lenders, end quote. The Obama administration announced it will be extending the Making Home Affordable program for another two years. The new expiration date is now set for December 31, 2015. The program offers help to struggling homeowners through solutions including the Home Affordable Modification Program, which has provided an estimated 1.1 million loan modifications for homeowners. As always, you can find more on these stories and all the latest headlines from around the industry here on our site. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you again on Monday. Until then, stay with DSNews.com for all of your most relevant default servicing news.